Joel, keep going. Push, push, push. Meat shield, Dado. Meat shield. That's exactly what I'm doing. Yeah. Watch, <laughs> watch right here, right here. They did it. Uh, it down. Uh, more, 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 more on the end of that hallway. Into that yeah, hallway. The shield just wasn't meaty enough. No, it was As not. It come to not pass. enough meat in that shield to protect him. <laughs> okay, everyone fall back to the center and let's see what happens next. Ten seconds to New Spark. The score's very close right now. So. Always is when they're not running that bet. Yep. When they're fighting each other, these two teams are very evenly matched from a team death match. You know, if, if all you're going to do is slay, these two teams are pretty evenly matched, which is why the tactics and the strategy and the objective that you've created here in the Rift, very important. So, Triple Rec has the spark. Let's check in with their comm channel. And that's a score. Wow, nice. And you yep. saw any of the enemy team members that were there trying to defend, uh, they just get you know, destroyed when that rift gets ignited. Yeah, that's a, good, that's a good opportunity to really run up the score. You slam that spark home, you ignite the rift, you detonate the defenders, and in the confusion that ensues, they were even able to mop up a Maybe few more Maybe you get yourself a, a double or a triple. Maybe even get yourself, yep, charge up those supers. It all counts. Yep. There are so many variables that you have these people tracking at any moment in time. Heavy ammo's back in six, ba six five seconds. Heavy ammo available. Team Triple Rec has the spark. Let's listen in. They've owned it for most of the match. Except for just that. Yep. Still got heavy, still got heavy. Shut down pretty yeah, quick. Shut down very quickly. Heavy just entered the match too, so we're gonna see some people get taken down. Spark's coming back in about 15 seconds. So Holtzman has his super. He's running low on ammo. We're gonna see what he what he does here. Look at him trying to control the area right now. Oh, but he can't find no anyone. No, no targets. targets. There we go. Oh, found him. found him. That might have been enough. Yep, yes, yep, they, they got the rift. The rift. Huge wow, for Triple Rex team just screamed ahead. This could be their victory. This could be their victory. Let's not jinx it. I didn't just say that. <laughs> Double kill. New spark inbound. Who's in the middle to claim it? Sparks up, but they are, it's oh, like, oh, it's basically super versus super now. They are destroying each other. Yep. Uh -oh. Triple, yep. oh, you see the battle of the gods there. <laughs> nice. That was amazing. Nice work, and the gods cancel each other out. All right, let's listen to Flame Sword's team. This is their chance to come back. Slide, slide, slide. Nice try, nice try. Nice try. Okay, right, keep that crack up. down mm -hmm. so fast. So Flame Sword's got his hammer. Sounds good. Let's see when he decides to use it. There's only two minutes left, so they have a lot of ground to make up, which, to be fair, they can. If they can control that center, grab the spark and push it in. No one's touching that spark right now. Way too much fighting in the it center. It is dangerous. It's the danger zone. Take it. take it. Come on, take it. You're both there. Let's listen to uh, Triple Rex team now. Storm of chatter. Let's listen to Team Datto. Team Triple Rex. I'm not sure what they're talking about. I don't know now. what they're talking I, they about. They really either. should be talking about playing the game, but they seem to be discussing <laughs> Kevin Costner's filmography. Let's see how that works out for him. Maybe we'll hear about Dances with Wolves. Yeah. <laughs> Unorthodox strategy. <laughs> Heavy ammo collection, spark collection, it's all happening at once. Forty-five seconds left. The outcome of this seems slightly inevitable. I'm gonna call it. You're gonna
going to call it? I'm going to call Don't it. jinx it, DH. <laughs> okay, maybe I was too soon. Let's you? listen to Flame Sword. They're probably going to be their shot. In front of me. Help me out here. No help, no help. Not, I'm not there yet. Oh, you oh. Denied. denied. Denied right at the very a end. Although he did get a bunch down of good points prime. there. Yep. Some good points. Some good runner points. But no ignition. Yeah, 10 seconds left. Ten it seconds is remaining. not looking good for... Nope. That's it, kids. And with that hard-fought victory, Team Triple Wreck. Wow. And this, uh, the, the classy salute. salute at the end. Take a seat, boys. You've earned it. <laughs> all wow. right. Good game all around. That's the spirit. Handshakes. And that's it, the folks. Like Boom. Like exactly. they knew I wanted to get like onto my game, and they knew I wanted to. <laughs> Any of these combatants should <coughs> Good team job, Triple Wreck. Flame Sword. Um, uh, triple wreck, nice attempt. Join us the news <laughs> Flame Sword, get, get up here. Flame sword as well. So uh, let's let's take a look at the uh, at the replay. Would you say you guys are sweaty right now? This is yeah, a good we're game. We're all, you know, it's it's good air conditioning. AC, here, yeah, AC is nice. <laughs> <in> <laughs> here. I can't complain. <laughs> so uh, talk to us about what you've learned about Rift today. Tell our audience at home how you carried the day, how you won the matches. Rift is really fast paced. And it's it's very very tactical. Check it out right here. Of, um, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> those melees are so crazy in the new warlock. Um, it's you know it, there's a lot of strategy. It's it's mostly communication though. It's you got to be smart about you know when you're gonna try to make a play uh, with the spark. Sometimes uh, there were situations where we knew we couldn't maybe get a dunk, but it's all about you know just trying to get as close as possible because you get those points um, for getting closer. Uh, to the base, um, I think that was really the key. Obviously, you know, doing well in terms of kills and stuff can help as well. But um, yeah, you know, it was a great match. Some of those were really close, and it could have gone either way. Yeah, there wasn't a single matchup in the entire exhibition where it was completely obvious. You know, and yeah. these were some tense matches. You guys had see some great of the communication new ships there. The aisle. Uh, you know, I loved uh, I loved the chatter about the meat shield. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You guys were kind of echoing a lot of the things that Lars and I were saying, and you know, it's like it's about working together it's about traveling in packs so well, uh, and i think that's that's what's so cool about this because it's so different it's there's so much room to develop strategies and and techniques and things with all the different subclasses and you know the different maps it's it's really fun and flame sword it was, it was intriguing uh definitely early on from playing we used to all just grab the spark it felt like but then finally it became a defense type of thing like you yeah. wouldn't push for the spark unless you got two or three dead then you would go for it and go on a full on front like you guys were doing in the last game and yeah. just be aggressive as you can still making the amazing plays i think you had the best <laughs> solar <laughs> that <Titan. was> <laughs> you had some amazing hammer yeah, yeah the there. stoppage at yeah. the end yeah that was I, I thought from that i was like all right we're gonna play off this hype right here we're gonna push and <laughs> i looked at the clock it was like oh there's only 30 seconds left <laughs> you can't do much being down 4,000, i think we were so yeah but that was an incredible play i enjoyed it that's why I, i've been grinding that character <laughs> sure well you know we love to create those personal hero moments yeah. so and like we said too, it's it was these were compressed games, right? So like even in some of those matches, it's entirely possible yeah. you guys would have had the the time to come back. Mm -hmm. So and yeah, anything can happen. You know, you yeah. make the big plays like that. So that's what's really exciting. Yeah, it's fun. Can't complain. I cannot wait till September fifteenth yeah. either. <laughs> so uh, let's uh, have both of our team captains uh, just throw it right to the camera. Um, on September fifteenth, when the Taken King comes out, give our uh, audience at home one tactical note. What's the one thing they should keep in their head when they play Rift? You first. Make the plays dunk the thing in the, the thing. There you go. Dunk the thing in the thing. <laughs> there you go. Here and flame sword. If no one is shooting you and you have the spark at the rift, make sure you moonwalk backwards into it. Definitely. Oh yeah. Okay. Backflips for style points. <laughs> so uh, we actually have a lot more time. Uh, we have more game modes that we can play. Uh, anybody interested in some mayhem clash? Yes. Let's do it. <laughs> All right, so we're going to sit our combatants back down. Don't go anywhere because uh, this ain't over. Uh, we still have some games to play. We still have some audience and stream. So uh, the show must go on, and uh, we're going to sort uh, the crucible for some mayhem clash action. It's going to be all supers all the time. So uh, go ahead and get yourselves comfortable. Uh, get your game faces back on. Uh, Mayhem Clash is uh, team deathmatch. We simplify things. Yes. Tactically. We'll simplify. Yes. But we make it a lot more chaotic we because your super abilities recharge yeah. faster than ever, right? We make it super, super chaotic. Um, Shax gets very excited. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> you 
know, he's constantly, you know, all right, we'll check this out here just for a few moments while we, and we'll go and, uh, in. We still need a third for the really nightfall, fast. so I'm going to put a shout out on the Dragon's Den, see if I can get some peeps in here. You spawn in almost immediately after you die, so um, you end up just sort of throwing you know, throwing everything you have at everything that moves yep. the entire time. We ratchet the score up. Um, it's it's complete chaos. So as our, our teams put down their phones, put on their <laughs> cans, and get controllers back in hand, uh, we're going to set destination for Crucible. Mayhem Clash. Mayhem Clash is the new game. We won't be keeping score this time. We're just no, looking for is, people to do for some funsies. awesome things. Uh, three new supers, three new subclasses coming to Destiny the Taken King in September 15th. Yep. They are. They are the, uh, we have the Warlock, the Stormcaller, right? The, uh, Hunter, the Night Stalker, and the, uh, Sunbreaker for the Titan. So, uh, a different damage type for each of them, which, uh, gives them a really unique new ability. So, uh, team deathmatch play in action. You see people uh, configuring their inventories, yep. see people swapping some different weapons, thinking about some of the different ways in which they'll fight. Changing it up. Changing it up. Yeah. yeah so we've, uh, we've wiped the scoreboard. Uh, equal combatants. There are no winners and losers in this room right now. These are people who just want to kick a little bit of ass, <laughs> take some names, maybe settle a few scores, and uh, see if they can become the next uh, focal point of the highlight reel after the match. Yeah, absolutely. So it seems as if they are in orbit and descending. Chat is still lively. <laughs> when isn't it lively, Deej? When they're not streaming. Ah, oh, that's true. That's true. When it doesn't exist. Oh, I'm not doing trials. All right. Here we go. Taking a look at some of the new weapons in the foundries. I don't uh, do PvP. The Soros pulse rifle. Not for a couple more weeks. <laughs> This is something that uh, you might just acquire from the gunsmith. Uh, I've never even done Iron Banner, let alone Osiris. I need to step up and get a couple levels built on my characters uh, in Crucible. Uh, but we'll step into that a little bit later. Today. And watch how fast these new supers charge. All right, folks, this is a new Mayhem mode PvP. Faster respawns, faster super recharges. Uh, we had a little extra time after... Uh, Triple Wreck won the best of seven against Flame Swords team with a 4 1 knockout. We'll be going live here in a minute. We'll put a little shout out on our Dragon's Den for uh, Nightfall. Just for fun. We're just kind of grinding them out. I don't need the coins. I and, mean, you know, maybe I'll get some exotics I don't have. There's four, four weapons I need I could get from Nightfalls and one pair of gauntlets. Every other exotic I have, or I can only get other more specific games. How an engagement like this changes up the team chatter. <clears throat> if we do have some extra time today, you know, we might step in to do some other stuff. Now, next week's folks, we're going to be uh, busting open the vault and defeating Crota with both normal and hard modes for uh, teaching as well as earning. Then, following week, we'll be stepping into the Prison of Elders, 28 through 35. And then, on the final week before the launch of the Taken King, we're stepping into the Crucible full time all week long. And have some fun in between that. Where the hell is he? What? That was a very fast I think this particular situation could be I'm so confused. massively improved by lightning grenades. Holtz man. Hello. All right, grab the heavy gun. Hi. Hello. Oh, I feel like I'm just going to get super instantly as soon as I pick this up. Only two rockets. Bungie, please. Oh, we, don't, we don't have the heavy increase boots, do we? Oh, no, yeah, we don't. Oh. What? We got a storm caller. Yeah, storm caller, shut together, them together, down. Together. No. Come out from around that corner. I heard hammers. Okay. No nope. arrow. Nice. Good stop. Good stop. It was awesome. <laughs> it was awesome. <laughs> Arc Warlock looking for targets. Nice. Nice. We're only going to watch one or two rounds of this at most, center. and then we'll be swapping oh, over to our yes. game. <laughs> yeah, so a bit more super usage in Mayhem. I would love to step into Osiris, folks. I really would. But I would just get pwned and killed, and my team would be mad. And I don't want to go in and somebody be like, I can carry you. I'd, sure, if I wasn't streaming and no one ever saw it and I didn't have to worry about it and the shameful, like, dishonor of it. Haha. <laughs> That and so whenever somebody say? says, oh, carry me, then later they're always like, I carried you, or I carried him, blah, blah, blah. It looks yeah. like someone switched to uh, cool. Blade Dancer. Oh, oh wow. Look at old school, and the huh? smoke. Yeah. Hmm. Looks like the throwing knife is in the new so subclass for the hunter. It's, it's so frantic, Good to know. So fast. <laughs> <laughs> I know.